Hi Leo, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading. This is for the week of September 26, 2022. Okay. If you guys are seeking a personal reading at JackieTomlin.com. Uh, first of all, a Taurus may or may not resonate with some of you guys. This is a week of getting what you want. Now that we have cleared summer and fall, you can get ready for a fast pace. Okay. Things are just coming at you quickly. Plans, travel. All of this coming at you quickly is asking you to get the rest that you can while you can. Uh, prepare for a new emotional path. There's some brief flirting going on. Just, I've got everything. It's like at the day that fall begins, everything opens up wide for my Leos. Okay? First card up, we have the Hermit. Absolutely. This says you guys are on the right path. Trust where you're being led. Now, when, you're, when you have the Hermit, this tells me you may have some scattered energy around you or something that doesn't feel right, but it is assuring you you are on the right path. We also have the Ace of Swords. New beginning is in communications. Okay, it's how you communicate with others and how they communicate with you. But bottom line is you're about to reconnect with someone you have not heard from in a long time. Now, don't forget we're under retro, that past pole energy, up until October 2nd. So a lot of past people could reoccur. The Nine of Swords, this may be causing you a loss of sleep, the shift in energy. Uh, perhaps you're having problems falling asleep or having problems staying asleep, but it is a disruption in your sleep pattern, okay? With that, I have the Six of Pentacles, financial balance. Something's coming in to balance you out, uh, perhaps to the point that you can help someone else, else out center of the reading we have the pope this is a dominant prominent person uh take charge type person this is someone that kind of comes in to save the day for you guys okay and with that we have the star the star is coming in with wish fulfillment now with that wish fulfillment you need to know that any delays that occur this week of the 26th just work to your benefit okay aggravating as it is but working to your benefit also have the full love the energy of the full there there's definitely some travel plans going on here but the fool tells me you know you're done with the past and you're ready to take a leap of faith you're getting ready to jump in with both feet and try something new and something that's going to be good for you okay and we have the queen of swords someone who may come in and offer some advice someone who might be kind of scornful or have a sharp tongue about them but has the best of intentions or has your best interest at heart okay uh for some of you a virgo may or may not resonate five of wands someone in the family someone in the inner circle not real pleased with you right now don't see conflicts i just see that the tension is high okay and i think it's over a decision that you have made so leo let's go a little bit further with this this again is for your week of september 26 2022 and on that hermit there's movement on the home front someone moving in the home someone moving out the home rushing energy not thinking things through is what i want to say <laughs> but there's definitely movement on the home front on the ace of swords you guys have the eight of pentacles now eight of pentacles comes in with money in addition to perhaps you're selling something um Perhaps it's a side job, some kind of side hustle, second job, something like that. But there's money in addition to your regular pay there. Um, we also have an unexpected offer coming in. This could be an unexpected offer of love or perhaps just an unexpected offer of help. Um, help. And I want to throw out a Pisces. May or may not resonate. Then we have the Chariot. Now, you know, guys, the Chariot is my favorite card in the deck, okay? Starting that reading out with you getting what you want, this just affirms that, okay? The chariot's your yes answer. It does say you get what you want and what you desire. But it's going to come rushing in, and it comes in when you least expect it, okay? And that's going to apply from now toward that time frame of the unexpected, which is the 2nd of October. The Emperor, again, center of the reading, the man doesn't have to be a man. I don't want to say it, but it came out, so let's roll with it. Dominant, prominent, take charge type person coming in to save the day. Okay? Creating change. You are surrounded by healing energy, and some people don't want to hear it. I mean, I'm just 
calling it the way I see it, okay? This, for a lot of you, is going to be an emotional healing. It's like getting over someone or something that has done you wrong in the past, and you're moving forward. And some people are not going to uh, want to see you move forward, okay? On the full card energy, you could be moving forward in love or a relationship, because there's a strong relationship here. If I have single Leos out here, this is going to be significant, okay? Uh, perhaps the one that you're meeting or the one that you're dating, you're actually moving in together or you're in a, in a relationship or you're being presented with a relationship. If you are already in that relationship, you're actually ascending to another level. Okay. So on the queen of swords, we have the three of swords. Be warned. Threes, a crowd, third party, unwanted advice and or opinion. Someone putting their nose in your business. Okay. And we have the Knight of Cups, unexpected offer of love. So yeah, you're looking strong in your love life, but overall it's a week of getting what you want. Bonus card for the center of the reading. Spiritual blessing as well as a financial blessing. But overall, Leo, take the time to count your blessings this week. It is a week of getting everything. Thank you guys for watching. JackieTomlin.com for personal readings. And I'll see you soon. Bye.